Thank you, Justin. Uh, just for everybody, this is Justin Straker, is the principal of Integral Ecology Group and one of the guest speakers at the upcoming Cumulative Effects Conference in Kamloops, being hosted by CE Analytic. Thanks for spending a little bit of time to talk about Cumulative Effects with us today, Justin. You're most welcome, Barry. Thanks for the invite. I thought I would just run through a few different questions so that people who are considering the conference can get a sense of uh, some of the content they can expect to hear and also get to know some of our amazing speakers like yourself. Now, when I visit your company's website, Justin, Integral Ecology Group, the first message that I see is people plus ecosystems. Uh, and how your company's work is really dedicated to researching and improving relationships between humans and our environment. Could you elaborate on how holistic cumulative effects approach is part of that? Sure. I mean, I, I guess I think that although the way uh, many of us live today can sort of feel increasingly removed from this fact, we're all uh, very dependent, dependent in the extreme um, on our the environments around us and natural processes for our well-being. And I think we are most of us are kind of aware of some mounting stressors and feedback loops around this from you know the wildfires that have been really prevalent in bc right. in the last couple of years that have affected um you know not only environments but the way people are living in those environments people's homes um you know whether it's our kids worrying about what climate change means for their future those sort of things um so I think we're all kind of aware of those feedback loops and when we started our company we were and we were and continue to work in both a sort of um, ecological scientific field and um, doing cultural work. And one of the things that we wanted to recognize is that neither of those things really exists um, sort of isolated from the other, right? right? So there are no human communities that aren't affected by the environments around them. And increasingly, I mean, I think we've sort of fully achieved this in my lifetime, there's no, um, environments that aren't in some way affected by um, human communities and their activities. And so I think that against that kind of backdrop, um, if we want to do a better job of sort of charting our course in the future, we need to understand um, we need to understand how we got to where we are today and how the sort of mounting um, decisions that we've made in the past have got us got us here and how we can make those decisions um, differently maybe sometimes the same in the future to, to get where we want to go and we can't do that without um, we can't do that without understanding this sort of accumulation of decisions we've made which you call holistic cumulative effects 